so we have already learned about creating fields but you must be thinking if there is a way to track the history of the fields whatever changes we are making in salesforce i have a question how to track them there should be something in salesforce through which we can track things in salesforce what your users are doing when they are logging in why they are not able to log in if they are getting any login errors all these things can be tracked through field tracking history so let's take a look what is field tracking history and how we can do it in salesforce so for example if you want to track the history of the fields then you have field history tracking feature option available which you can enable it and whatever changes you will make it will be tagged against the history and you will be able to see it so let's say we try to enable the field history tracking on account level in order to do that you just need to go to setup select your account in object manager click on it go to fields and relationships you will see set history tracking you can select enable it first after you enable it you can select up to 20 fields and you will be able to track the history whoever is changing these fields for example i want to track who is changing the owner source name and you can check whatever fields are important for your business and you can just mark them i'll simply mark these fields and click save now if i try to change the account name as i have enabled the history so my name will show there so i'm going to change the name to from tcs to wipro and save it so there is a activity history related list which we need to drag in order to track the changes so let's go to the page layout and put the related list select the account layout which is assigned we will go to now related list and we will put account history related list here let's save this let's refresh this as you can see my name is appearing here when and what i did on this particular account if i try to change the source of the account or even if i'm changing the owner this will be tagged because i have marked as history tracking for that particular field so this will also be captured here so this is a very good feature to explore which will help you to find out who is making what changes on your objects now this is about field history tracking now let me go to feed you have feed tracking available as well if you just enable feed tracking you will be able to select up to 20 fields and if you enable this option for your object your users can follow records of that object type and then you can select the fields to track so that whenever your users can see feed updates when those fields are changed on the records they follow for example if i try to select account object from here and i select active checkbox account source revenue all related object i click save and the field tracking is now enabled so now if i try to make any changes on let's say active i'm going to mark this as no now if you go to related you will be able to track that and if if you go to chatter you will be able to see that information there as well that this record was updated and you will be able to track the changes that the active was changed from a blank value to no so this will be tracked under activity history account history as well as on the chatter if you enable feed tracking now this is about enabling field history tracking how you can track the changes on the fields what your users are doing now if you want to track what changes are being made from the backend by your users who is doing what changes on the metadata setting then you can 
check in the setup audit trial. Let's see how we can do that. If you want to check what changes people have made, you can track all the history through setup audit trial. You just have to type in view setup audit trail here and you can check what they have done. So for example, you can see my name here that I have created this validation rule. I've changed the error. I have created the field dependency. I have just enabled the field history on this. I've customized the account page layout. If I want to see more, I can simply download this setup audit trail. And then in this Excel file, you will be able to see the whole data, what this person has done for the last six months. Let me open this file and show you. So this is how you can track. If you find something is fishy in your instance and you're not able to track who has done the changes, this is the best thing for you. You can just download it and find the culprit. Hopefully you will like this session too. Stay tuned for the next videos.